How to Sail a Sabo Sailing is a great sport and easy to learn on a simple, cat, rigged, mainsail only, sailboat. Sabos are the simplest one, designed boat to rig and sail, and very difficult to capsize with either weight or speed. Rigging is intuitive and parts are easy to make or cheap to replace if they break or are lost. Rigging on land is much easier than rigging on water. Steps 1. With the mast lying on the ground with boom extended, slide the sleeve of the sail onto the mast until the tip of the mast is at the end of the sleeve. 2. Tie down hull, tightly to mast cleat, securing the remaining line with a series of half, hitch knots. 3. Secure the out hull, by tightening it around the clue and securing it to the clue cleat on the underside of the boom. Do not take up the extra line with half hitch knots if the wind is strong. 4. Gather the boom, mast, sail, and main sheet together and insert the base of the mast into mast step of sabo hull. 5. Place the leeboard on the leeboard holder on the starboard side of the hull, securing it with a leeboard nut and washers if necessary for proper tightening. Keep out of the water until the boat is launched and water is deep enough to keep it from hitting bottom. 6. Put the tiller rudder assembly in boat, but do not install on the hull until water is deep enough. 7. Carry the boat into the water, utilizing the gunnels as handhold, not the corner pieces. 8. When the water is deep enough, usually about knee deep, attach the rudder to the boat using the pintles on the rudder and the gudgeon on the boat. Be sure the tiller and extension go underneath the traveler before making way. 9. Lower the lee board and make sure it is secure. 10. Attach the main sheet to the traveler with the spring clip at the end of the main sheet. 11. Sit facing the sail near the center of the boat, close to the center thwart if it has one, and closely observe the sail for catching wind. 12. Shift your body entirely across the boat and sit facing the sail on the other side if the wind shifts and the boom comes across, or if you choose to tack and the boom comes across. Tips Make sure that the wind is appropriate for your experience and ability. Too light a wind and you won't go anywhere, and too strong a wind may result in capsize. Your back should always be against the side of the boat, not against the rear thwart or the center thwart. A shackle key is recommended and very useful for rigging a sabo. Steering is very forgiving on a sabo. Things Sabo hull Mast boom assembly Leeboard, leeboard nut washers Tiller rudder assembly. Sail. Main sheet.